Assalamualaikum in the name of Allah the most gracious and the most merciful first and foremost I would like to extend my deepest praise to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who has given me the strength, determination and courage to implement this project Firstly, I would like to express my special thanks to my dedicated biology teacher, teacher Nick Zakia Binti Awang This project could not have been possible without the help of her In addition, thousands of thanks I would like to express to my mother and all of my friends for their helpful insights and stimulating comments I would also like to express my apology for any mistake in carrying out this task. I am truly delighted for this project will bring benefits to others. Fruit often occur during the fruit season in Malaysia. Farm produce such as fruits have to be processed as soon as possible because they can easily spoil. This is a problem because it can cause wastage due to overharvesting in one season. In addition, these fruits are rarely available during the off season. Therefore, by using the concept of movement of substances across the plasma membrane, the project is proposed to solve this problem. One way to overcome this problem is to pickle them. According to Journal of Functional Food Available All in 29 April 2020, the primary advantage of pickling is food preservation. Pickling prevents spoilage and greatly extends shelf life. Furthermore, pickling as food preservation was particularly important in agricultural societies before household refrigeration. It increased stock of food by transforming leftover into something edible. It also improved the taste and gives flavor to food. Pickling is also a global culinary art. You may have tried halal pickles in New York City, Korean kimchi, Japanese miso pickles, salsa to Mexico, and some foyer in our own country. The basic category includes pickles soaked in salt brine to encourage fermentation, the growth of good bacteria that make a food less vulnerable to bad spoilage causing bacteria. Common examples of fermented pickles include fruit-based fermented pickles such as mango fruit, which is I will show you in this video. But before that, according to what I have learned in biology subject, while preparing pickles, there are spontaneous flow of solvent molecule from low concentration to high concentration, which is called osmosis. Osmosis refers to the net movement of water molecule from an area of high water potential to an area of low water potential through a selective permeable membrane. The selective permeable membrane is permeable to water but impermeable to some solids such as sucrose molecules. The same situation occurs in cells through the phospholipid by layer. Without wasting time, this is a process of making pickle mango. The purpose of this project was to overcome wastage due to over harvesting in one season by using the concept of movement of substances across the plasma membrane. The results of this project supported the concept of hypertonic solution. Salt water solution has a high solid concentration and low water potential. So, salt water solution is hypotonic to mango and water diffuses from mango to salt water solution by osmosis. Water will diffuse out of the vacuoles. Vacuoles and cytoplasm will shrink causing the plasma membrane to be pulled away from the cell wall. This is known as plasmolysis, which is causes the plant cell to shrink. Make sure whenever prepare pickle, it is necessary to dry the mango for preservation purpose. Due to water present in cells get evaporated and making the cells dry. However, as put mango in lime water solution, the process of hypotonic osmosis occurs. The lime water solution has low solid concentration and high water potential. So lime water solution is hypotonic to mango and water diffuses from a lime water solution to mango. That's why even after drying the raw mango, when we make pickle out of it and leave it for a few days, we feel the pieces of pickles to be tender and moist. Mm, and the sugar is mostly just for flavor, but it does also act as preserver. However, if you don't want the added sweetness, the salt alone should be sufficient for preservation. So, that's all from me. Thank you for lending your ears.